Hello, welcome to Excel Tips by the HR Diary. Today, I'm going to show you how to find the correlation for sick leave with Excel. Correlation is useful to find out the extent which two variables are related. The coefficient sign, the plus and minus, indicates the direction of the relationship. A coefficient of positive one means there is a positive correlation. For example, the taller a person, the heavier the person is. A coefficient of negative one means there is a negative correlation. Example, the more it rains, the less sales you make. A coefficient of zero means there is no correlation. For example, there is no correlation between the amount of coffee you drink and your intelligence. In this spreadsheet, I've got the working hours in column B and the sick leaves in column C. Note that there are no blank cells in this data. Click on any empty cell and then uh, click on the function button on the toolbar. Right. And then in the search box, type Corel and click go. And you'll see the Corel appear here. Then click OK. In array one, select the column with the working hours data. In array two, select the column with the sick leave data. Then click OK. And Excel generates the coefficient, the, no, the correlation coefficient here. The positive uh, correlation of 0.75, which is here, shows a positive correlation between working hours and sick leave. It, it shows a strong correlation between these two. All right, that's it. Thanks for watching Excel Tricks by the HR Diary. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the HR Diary channel.